Hey man, it's Vader G here, welcome back to the channel. Had a couple of people ask me uh, in different groups and also on the uh, YouTube channel who is more powerful out of Dormammu or Thanos um, in Alliance Battle Extreme. So what we're going to do is actually take them both for a real quick run and I'm going to qualify it by saying I have zero idea what I'm doing at Dormammu um, but what I've done is set them up with uh, roughly equivalent builds um, similar sorts of Odin's Blessings uh, Dormammu has a mythic uniform, Thanos has uh, legendary um, that's just the way it is in the test server, I can't really change that uh, CTPs of Rage, uh, both got Awakened ISO sets uh, and if we have a look at the stats they're kind of, I mean Dormammu's got more dodge but that's probably just due to the um, additional uniform option and just the way that he is actually um, kitted out stat wise I'll have a quick look at Thanos. Uh, like I said, legendary uniform. I can't do anything about that in the test server. We can't upgrade that. Same sort of uh, ISO set and similar amount of Odin's Blessings, to be perfectly honest. So um, his stats look like that. He's a little bit low on crit damage, a little bit lower on uh, dodge. Um, but, you know, I'm kind of I'm kind of weighing up the fact that Thanos has a you know an established rotation uh, Dormammu for me doesn't. Um, now, obviously, on today's Alliance Battle Extreme, uh, where the Beast has the um, has a silence weakness uh, or is subject to silence, uh, Thanos does not have a silence. So automatically on today's day, uh, Dormammu wins automatically. I mean, he's gonna he's he's gonna perform okay, right? We've already seen that when I did the real rough Alliance Battle run earlier, but um, and, and Thanos has nothing that can sort of uh, compete with that. Having said that, there would be no reason in, in uh, Universal Villain why you couldn't actually have Thanos and Dormammu on the same time, uh, on, the, on the same team, if you're not using the Hellabug, I suppose. And who knows if the Hellabug even works anymore. I, I'm not going to test that in this. So what we're going to do, we're going to take a quick, quick run here with um, Thanos. I'm just going to use Heller in team, just... Just because, just because, why not? Um, and I'm only going to go to the first minute. I'm not going to run the whole alliance battle. And we'll take a bit of a look and see what sort of score we get. Playing on a phone, guys, not my usual iPad. So uh, I do find it a bit trickier. And obviously the beast is a little bit, a little bit different. Like he doesn't come at you and that sort of thing. He kind of, he's pretty lazy, this beast. He just sort of, sort of sits back and, and uh, lets you punish him a little bit. Um, so we'll get into it. Alright, so we got the proc right where we want it for the tier 3. What are we up to? Around about 500, 500k at halfway. Well, at the half minute mark. Oh, bit of a delay there on the 5th, sorry. So this test server conditions are quite interesting, right? Because we don't get any of the Alliance uh, bonus type stuff, any of the Alliance bonus stats. So where are we up? We're at a million. All right, say around about there. Let's freeze it there. Close to 1.2 million. That's the target at a minute. Now, obviously, uh, he cannot cancel Royals, right? So this is, this is the issue with Thanos. So what we're going to do is we're going to run the same team, uh, just just for to be equal, and we're going to change it up and use Dormammu instead of Thanos, and see how we go. I might do a couple of runs with Dormammu, uh, just because I have no idea what I'm doing, and I'm really just button mashing, right? So he seems like he does pretty heavy duty uh, damage on his four skill, so I'm going to let that run a little bit. I'm not sure of when you can cancel any of the skills, to be honest. But um, his fifth school sometimes does seem difficult to cancel. So what are we aiming for? 1.2 million, right? So let's see if we can get close to that. And I'm just going to get onto this tier 3 school as quickly as I can. 
Wow, it's stacking up pretty good, eh? Get that planet skill right on the beast head, man, and we're ahead of Thanos. We're ahead of Thanos at the halfway mark. That one skill, I just the one skill won't actually activate. I press it, look, I press it about five times. Oh, there we go, it's done something. All right, so let's get going. And yeah, we're not worried about this. The raw cancel, and with an absolutely spam fest rotation, he's ahead of Thanos. Just we go. We'll try it again and see if. Um, well, there's no rotation. I shouldn't say spam fest rotation. Just a spam fest. We're ahead of. Thanos. So hopefully this gives you a little bit of an idea of his power level. Thanos legendary uniform, Dormammu mythic, still Dormammu, totally um, totally brand new. I'll try and start with the fifth this time and into the fourth. That, fifth, that first skill just does not want to go Jumped out of the tier 3 a little bit there on this run. Still got pretty decent numbers. Okay. Go, 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 go. That planet on him. Oh, now he jumped forward a bit. Sixteen seconds left, we're already up to 1.1. Okay, we need this. Ah, uh, he's jumped out of tier three. All right, we still smoked it. Still up around at sort of 1.3. I'm going to do one more, and hopefully, if we land that uh, that that um, tier three, hopefully, we can get up around that sort of 1.4 uh, mark. That'd be a nice score to hit. Um, but yeah, that's weird. The, the beast jumped away, and and the tier three. Kind of dissipated, didn't it? It did nothing. Okay. Planet. Giant. Four skill. And no matter what we do, we really can't activate that first skill. Alright, getting ready for the tier three here. Proc. Please. Can't remember what effect the one skill has, but hopefully it's not anything important because it's just, no matter if I try and press it or not, it's just not happening. All right, come on. Let's throw the planet over there. No, last run was better. Tell you what, he's pretty cool to play though. Just got to do it one more time. Just to take this video out to 10 minutes to be perfectly honest. So yeah, guys, pretty powerful unit. Pretty powerful. I'll be interested to see how it goes in uh, PvP as well. Look, and I am warming up to this Frost Beast. The look of the Frost Beast is cool. The look of the arena is cool. It is, it's a nice change. I know I went a, a bit negative before on the whole Alliance Battle stuff, but um, I was kind of, I don't know, I think I had my hopes up for something that might have been a bit unrealistic. I think I was expecting like a some massive changes and that, that was probably just a stupid expectation of me to be honest. Come on. This actually looks like a slightly better run. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. 
Yeah, too far away. All right, guys. There you go. Dormammu versus Thanos. Um, let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks, guys.